Okay, hey, very exciting times here, guys. Finally, we have the Centrotech 16 step sequencer here done in its final casing. It's pretty radical. It's got these great CCCP graphics from like the 50s, sort of a uh, you know, Soviet style thing. Anyhow, this sequencer is awesome. It comes fully assembled just like this. You can also buy a kit on our site too, but um, it's great. It's got a lot of features. It's got uh, a standard gate. Uh, it's got a reset out, S-trig out, um, clock out. Uh, it's got um, an external reset out. It's got an external reset um, clear, which allows you to use two of these sequencers together in the same time, and they'll reset at the, sa at the same reset. Um, it's got an 8 or 16 step switch. There's an 8 step switch here too that allows you to basically uh, go anywhere between 1 through 16 steps. So it's pretty cool. You can see it just goes to 3. Dick, 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 dick. Or I can do it all the way up to 8. If I put it over to the 16, it goes through all 16 steps. Got a CV out here. Pots per, um, per step. Uh, up is on. Middle is off, down is hold through. So what it does, if it's on the hold through, it takes the uh, voltage from the from the previous uh, step and it'll hold through that. So you can make some really great beats and things. There's also a nine and a five um, voltage switch that uh, basically kind of goes about an octave different. So if you switch that. So right now I've got it. Um, it's also got a manual hold button. You see that light go on there, sort of my fingers out of the way. Manual hold and then you can kind of like step through the steps. Uh, there's also a hard hold where you just hold it there and so you can really tune them into how you want. So I'm going to show you how it works. Uh, it's a, it's very cool. we got some best pricing. I think it's probably the best priced for what it can offer you um, out there as far as a 16-step sequencer. Um, also, there is a length of, 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 of how long the trigger will actually go. So it could be from staccato notes all the way through, all the way hold through. So um, the duty cycle will go through very, very short all the way um, went through 100%. So, um, what I'm doing here is I'm connecting it to my space drum synth uh, uh, through the, the the CV is going to the CV in on the on the on the space drum synth as well as the trigger for my gate is going in there. So it's triggering it per 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 um, per step here. And then I also got it going through my Echo Quest, which is our really cool pedal now too. So you're gonna hear some real spacey stuff. It's gonna be rad. And so I'll hopefully be able to show you kind of how it works. So I'm gonna turn the volume up here. Right now I got an eight step mode. Put it over to 16. These were all off. Turn back on. We're gonna adjust the tempo. Adjust. Move to the next one. It's got quite a good range. So we'll let it go through these. Speed it up. Also with the space drum synth, there's uh, quite a bit of different features to make it sound. Let's turn it up real fast. Add the delay of the echo quest in here. Add the LFO. Add 
some feedback? Tight delay. Let's whistle some steps. To the to the nine volts, it gets a little higher pitch. Drop it down. Drop the tempo again. Send the LFO back in here. A little feedback again. Okay, just a little demo. So anyway, you can see the uh, this this full made sequencer. It's very 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 cool. Um, we got them have have them online today. They're gonna start at a at an introductory price of four twenty nine. Anyway, check it out. Thanks a lot, guys.